So from here, we're going to go to our favorite website, which is the West Hill CS website, which is the computer science website for West Hill High School. And we're going to scroll down to the APCSA course. And instead of hitting these monikers, we're going to go to the APCSA page this time. So we're going to click on that. And you can see that all the tools used for the course are here. And what I'm interested in is this game right here called CSA Games. And we're going to click on that. And that's going to take us to this React engine that I was talking to you about. So let's click on that. And here is the React engine. And you can see that the React engine has a whole bunch of Java topics on here, strings, relational, Boolean, loops, arrays. And then if you hit mixed, it gives you like a random selection of questions. Now of these topics, the only one that we have studied so far is which one? No, we have not studied strings really. A little bit, tiny bit. Anyone? Relational operators. So we're going to click on relational. And you can see that in the box in black, there is a question. It says, which numbers are less than or equal to 65? And then you have to pick either none of these numbers, all of these numbers, or if there are certain ones, you have to pick them. So of this list, which ones would qualify? Yes, sir. 19. 19. So if you click 19 here, you can see the score went up to a 1, and it's giving you the next one. And here, they're asking you which ones are negative. So you hit none, and it goes to 2. Now it says which ones are 43. Now, if you pick the wrong answer, like 95 or all, like if you click on that, you can see it will show you which is the wrong answer, which was the right answer, and then you're, you're done, basically. Your score is frozen at 2. That's what you got. And then you have to hit restart to start all over again. Now, I'm going to, now you, you'll, get, you'll be like, oh, this is easy after a few minutes. So then you make it more challenging by hitting this button right here, which is, gives you compound relational operators. So let me show you that one. So it gives you that. So now it says, what numbers are bigger than 15, bigger than or equal to 15, and less than 42? Any in here that, that applies to? None. none. So you hit none here like that. Now, you'll be like, after like another five minutes of this, you'll be like, oh, this is too easy, Mr. Sarkar. So then you hit this challenge mode over here like that. And let me just bring up one of the, look at that. See that? So that gets like, it can get really hard. And here we're combining the relational operators, or and and, with uh, not operators. And uh, so there's some uh, logical operators mixed in there. Now let's look at this expression for a second. You see it has or here and an and here. Which one's going to be done first? <coughs> yes, Miss Caitlin? The and is going to be done first because our last class we learned that the order of operations means and is done first. So you have to account for that when you figure out what the answers are. Now my suggestion, we're going to play this for about 10 minutes today. My suggestion is you go ahead and play this. But just so you know, if you turn on the sound and turn on the timer, the level of stress is going to increase by an order of magnitude in this game. And that it, controlled gentle stress is where learning happens. Okay? So go ahead and feel free to play this slowly until you get used to it. But then, sound and timer, and then you go for it. Okay? So you go ahead and play now for a few minutes. And I'll meet you back here in about uh, five or seven minutes, and we'll see who has the high score.